Hello again loves, Rebecca here and welcome to a Trace Jolie Kit Club unboxing. These are March kits. Let's just, uh, I'm always afraid I'm going to cut the products. All right. Whoop, whoop. Let's see what we got. Ooh. Oops. <laughs> Alright, so I have got the card kit, the scrapbooking kit, and the mixed media kit this month. Look at all these fun things. Alright. Mm. And I have candy. So, let's pull open because I probably should have had this in advance my immediate um, apologies for that let's see what we got here sorry girls and guys I'm trying to find all right so this And this is the scrapbooking kit. Okay. And then this and this is the card kit. And then all of this lovely is the mixed media kit. So let's go through them. I had to get my phone. So let's start with the scrapbooking kit and see what gloriousness we have. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and tuck that in, right? And we'll scoot that over there. So we have got Cherished Elegance. Um, memory place so this is the collection and look at how cute this is look at the little cherubs and the little doves lots of fussy cut options there then we have this beautiful paper and that one is called memory place cherished elegance number one so okay so it's cherished elegance is the line memory place is the collection then we have exquisite number two, which is this right here, and it is already a pre-done paper, right? You just plop some photos on there, add a few embellishments, and you have got it done, but that is beautiful. I can totally see myself fussy cutting this out, you guys. Oh, look at that. It's got like a little, um, little fishnet on the ground there. Beautiful color palettes. This is timeless. Three. So some fussy cut options. You can make a little book cover. I think that's kind of cute. Oh, look at that. And you have like the insides. Oh my god, I love that. More fussy cut options. Allure, number four. Look at that. Oh, so much going on there. I love it. And then the back is, again, a beautiful, beautiful page. Looks like it's got lace over the florals. Then we've got Grace number five, so more bookends to go in your little book there. I kind of, I, I actually really like that. So you can make like a mini album. And then we get some wood planks, and then this is Beloved number six with lots of cut aparts, and on the back are more cut aparts. So I think that is super cool to go with it. We have these lovely little key laser cut pieces. I was so curious at what these were. Antique cloches? I have no idea what that means. That is really cool. So it's like hard. Ooh, and we have some beautiful ribbon, lacy ribbon, and some lacy um, burlap florals. Oh my goodness. Ooh, ooh, and look at this beautiful, 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 beautiful floral bits 
And then we have the little die cut pack that goes with it. So you get some uh, frames. Let's just pull the, uh oh, I ripped it. And that is why we don't get too so excited. Oh man. Okay, that is like really stuck on there. Okay, that's all right. So let's just pull these out. And this um, card stack is, or painter paper is super um, thick. It's really nice quality. So we got Cherish. We got a frame that we can fussy cut out and make shaker packets out of. Beloved, some floral bits, the little lock and the crown. That's like the Irish Colladad to me. More floral bits, floral bits. Ooh, a feather, a little butterfly, more florals, some books, clock, true love, coffee cup, a little rose and a glass, a book, a postcard, another butterfly, a little cherub, more globed roses, shaker bucket, more globed roses, and then forever and always. That is so cute. Okay, and that is the scrapbooking kit. You guys so have to go pick this up. All right, so I've got that. And if I don't do this right now, I'm not going to be able to keep them together. And the goal is to keep them together. So, like, when I craft, I do start with, like, one of the kits and then add the rest of them in as needed. All right. So, let's grab this. Uh-oh. Last one. And I always write my little trash Jolie. March scrapbook kit twenty four. Okay, we should probably let that dry, huh? And I'll stick this in here. Fancy adhesive. And then we pop that on that. All right, next up, uh, let's do the card kit. I absolutely love the way that Kim, the owner of the company, curates these kits, you guys. They are so beautifully done. And I do feel honored to be a member of this team. Okay. Now. Uh oh. Things are falling. Things are falling everywhere. Let's give this time to dry, right? So this is the Trace Jolie March 24 card kit. We have some cards. Oh, I can make cards. <laughs> I know, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you get ten. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Tus, tus. There you go. And we've got the paper pack. Let's pull this out. Oh, come on. And this is the first time I'm seeing all this in person. So this is from Stamperia. And we have some beautiful fussy cut pieces. With a whole bunch of little words. Together in spirit, where is love, seek happiness. And then we have these beautiful 
pattern papers on the back, more fussy cut pieces. <gasps> I love it. Is that cord in the way? How unprofessional <laughs> am I? Apparently very. Okay. Oh, look at the little cards. Lace on top of wood. I love it. This is gorge. Oh, and a little doily. More fussy cut pieces. You can make a little envelope. Whoop. Oh, look at how pretty this is. Oh, wood grain with like a little crackle in it and some floral bits. You can totally fussy cut out those florals. Oh, you can fussy cut all that out. Oh, oh, in love. So that is the romantic collection from Stamperia, Romance Forever. And then in our bag full of details, we have got what will become shaker pockets for me, laser cut dies. And then we've got these cute little pink. I almost said yellow. I know. I'm not colorblind. I swear I know colors. I look at a color company. <laughs> for real. Pink little flowers. A clear stamp. Oh, I get a stamp. How cutie is that? I like it. So it's a Finnebar Clear Stamps 2013 Prima Marketing it is called. I do not know. I got nothing, but it looks like a little doily piece, so that's kind of cool. Ooh, and look, flower hearts. They're going to be 3D. Those are going to be really cool. And then last, but definitely not least, we have, <coughs> excuse me, we have tic-tac-toe. Or love. What is that? That's a V. Is that an X? I don't really know. I can't tell. Wood icons. So we have X's and O's and V's. What are V's? I mean, I get hugs and kisses, but... Hmm. Well, that's fun for me. I will have to look that up. Unless you know. Leave a comment down below. If I just been totally in the dark my whole life, it would not be the first time. Alright. Let's get this all stuck in there. I have to put it back. I know the OCD kicks in, takes over. All right. Let's get. All right. This stuck on here. Maybe we should put it here because you know that's going to fold over. Maybe it won't, but maybe it will. And now, the goodness that is the mixed media kit. Okay, so real quick and cool. Oh my goodness, I have got to figure out. You guys, is a Prima vintage wall base look, and then you hang it. Oh, and it's wood, and it feels. Oh, all right. What am I gonna do with this? Someone come up with an idea. <laughs> Mostly me. All right. We have decoupage in Carta de Riso. I don't know what that means. But it's like steampunk. For real. Okay. So we've got all kinds of fun little clocks. And it says time machine. And then over here it says voyage is fantastical. Be splendid and choose adventure. A train. Oh, adventure is waiting. I love that. And then we have stencil butter. I have been wanting to try this. I think I bought this, but I haven't used it yet. So sea foam stencil butter from the Crafters Workshop. And Lindy's Gang Magical Powders. Um, this is Bayou Boogie Gold. Add powder to water or your favorite medium to create custom paint. I can't wait to try that. And then in this little goodness over here, we have Stamperia... Glamour Gel, water-based um, mixed media in dark wood. Oh, I cannot wait to see what that does. I've never used that either. Oh my god, all of these I've never used. And then we do have some black gesso, so that's fun. I like gesso. And oh, little 
little pocket watches. You guys look, those are little pocket watches. I can make shaker pockets. Oh, I'm super excited. Okay, so you guys, you have got to head over to the Trace Jolie website. I will have that linked. <coughs> Excuse me, down below. Head over, pick yourself up one of these kits and make some magic with us this month. There's also um, a several challenges. So there's a mood board challenge and all kinds of fun stuff. So seriously, head over, enter the challenge. Um, I wrote that backwards, but it's okay. I have that messed all up. All right, we're going to move past that in my life. I've got to grab another bag, which, oh, I have them. I did. Oh, I almost lost them. Okay. You guys, I'm finding stuff all over the place. I just found that on the floor with my hair stuck on it. Okay. It's going to be okay, I promise. One day, it'll all make sense, my life, that is. All right, so yes, yeah, seriously, head on over, check it out, give them some love, sign up to the Facebook group, subscribe to the Trace Jolie um, YouTube channel. You will not be disappointed with the talent that is on the team and all the fun stuff that happens. And I am going to go get uh, to playing. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. And I'll see you later. Bye.